All right, so can you introduce yourself, please? Yeah, my name's Ron Garrett, or Ronald W. Garrett. Yeah. I'm from Greenwood, South Carolina, originally. About two weeks old, Daddy brought me up here. 1949, Rose and Pineville, right down the road here, about three miles. And uh, Dad and I built this store around 1965. It took us about two and a half years to build it. My name is Elizabeth Garrett. I'm Ron Garrett's daughter. Mm -hmm. And I do, I'm usually here throughout the day with my dad. Um, and today we actually, we're going to show you around. Um, this first room here, we have different antiques and everything. We also carry Native American jewelry. Um, it's all handmade here in the U.S. Uh, we're known for our turquoise and our jewelry. When did you start this business? Around 1965 when we started business. And the antique business, and, uh, then I became a, uh, went, went to college two years and became a, uh, a seaman. Went in the Navy out of York, Redding, Gettysburg, Pennsylvania, all through the southeast and uh, west, western New York states, Watertown, all thousands of antiques, and I became an antique auctioneer. I was an auctioneer for about 22 years. And then I started traveling Indian reservations in the uh, silver business, Indian business, and that's what I really like. Mm. My dad's side was Sam Mountain, Alabama, Cherokee. A lot of people were Germans. Basically, 40% Cherokee, 50% German, 70% French. Most of my mates out there was. Mm. Yeah, that's what I like. What makes us kind of unique also, we've got 83 different Indian tribes come to the store. We got them from the other day, we got them out here from Alaska. We might come in from Canada, California, Oklahoma, Maine, New Mexico. Arizona, Florida, that Native Americans come here from all over the Western Hemisphere, actually. Sometimes even South America, I had a few from the Amazon here. And I studied, I've been studying Indian culture and history for about 46, 47 years. I've got customers from all over the world come here. And my birthday was May 5th. Oh. Last week. Oh. And congratulations from some of our customers far away as Australia. Oh, happy birthday. Massachusetts. we got people from all Oh, it might be France. We have people from everywhere because we've been in business so long and if they buy something, usually I can tell them a little bit of the history. The history okay. behind where they purchase. And sometimes it's native work, I tell them what tribe. Okay. That makes it. That's what makes us a unique thing. Like I said, knowledge. But what we sell, we usually have a history behind it. We can tell where it came from or what it's even used for. Okay. Yeah. All right, that's cool.